The river is getting too white watery for this to be a good fish area. Oh look, fish fish alert. Fish alert. Could you imagine being whoever's working there? Just seeing this wild ass weirdo coming in here looking for fish. Just screaming, fish alert, fish alert! <laughs> Just a weird fisherman. Something like, my god, this madman. I think when he put on his hat, it started raining. What in the world? <laughs> you start thinking it's like an avatar of one of the nine divines. <laughs> I heard that her glade was nearby this area. Could this be as it was foretold in prophecy? <gasps> you are sent one, one of the chosen of Kinnereth. <laughs> Yes, fish alert, fish alert, I'm here for Kinnereth, fish alert! When we had last left the last dragonborn, they were continuing their adventures in and around the City of Solitude, this time looking for a house to break and enter and steal three coveted super cool items for the Thieves' Guild. But that was the least of their problems, for indeed, the last dragonborn sought none other than a few special fish. Yes, the pygmy sunfish and the pearl fish, which turned out to be more of a task to accomplish than they had suspected. Indeed, their adventuring sent them all along the northern coast and inlet surrounding Skyrim and Solitude itself, where they found all manner of strange thing. The water itself phasing into different forms of reality, guards going swimming, and also a little weird camp filled with oddities from another world, perhaps. Alas, there were no fish here, and so the Dragonborn turned their gaze elsewhere in Skyrim Land to seek out further fishes and further adventure. <laughs> this is the Elder Scrolls V, Skyrim. Welcome back. Whoop! There we go. <laughs> Do you like it? That one? That, that time we went with a little whoop instead of or so or shoot. Oh, fuck. Okay, that was a bad idea. You know what? We warmed up by this during the opening. Not, not, a, not a good idea. Okay. So I think what we need to do is head on out over to, what do you call it, land, right? Over to Labyrinthian. We'll turn in all the masks that we're hauling around. Free up some inventory space. And then I guess we'll go over and try to get the other fish, right? We'll try that. Okay. And if that doesn't work, then shit, I don't know what. Let's see, what's our best bet for getting out of here? Assuming no dragon appears and saves us. <sighs> I guess it's just, yeah, we just have to go around all the way back to Solitude, huh? Okay, let's fucking do it. We did see that dragon fly overhead, though, before. Maybe in going back this direction, it will, like, return? I can only hope. Well, no. go. And also, we may want to check out some of the other fishing spots in our Hell March. Uh, or Hafengar. Well, oh, shit, which one was it? Map. Over here. Yeah, our Hafengar unit here, like this other stream, you know? Let's see. Let's consult our fishing book again. Our fishing guide. Oh, shit. There we go. Let's see here. Yada, yada. Yeah, Easter. Yeah, okay. Pearlfish. Okay, this is one that we, we are seeking. Their name comes from the way they gather near clams along the northern shore. Strange, then, that it is not called a clam fish. I think you're full of shit here, dude. How do they gather a near clams along the northern shore? When they're only in temperate freshwater. Right? How does this even happen? They're only in fresh water. They're not in, like, salt water. Right? Huh. 
weird. Unless perhaps in the mystical world of the Elder Scrolls. Oh shit. A secret horker horking around. But perhaps in the secret mystical world of the Elder Scrolls. Oh shit, who is... Who is this out here? Fuck me, I can't even talk about the secret mystical world. Oh shit, it's a Night Lord Vampire. Oh my gosh, I got vampirism. Jeez. Okay. Ugh. Let's see. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh my gosh, look at Rallis go. Holy shit, Assassino. Okay. Cool. Wow, been a while since we've seen one of them, but you know, I guess the location is spot on. Makes sense that we see quite a few out here. We need to get rid of our curse here, our accursed curse, before it proceeds too far. Let's see here. Oh dear. There we are. Good. That should do it, right? Let me double check. Hmm. I think it did. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's be off and on our way, right? We'll head over to that. And then you know what? I'm thinking maybe we should get started with the companions before too long. Right? We should probably do some of that. Could be a good a good thing to do. Oh dear. Alright. And I gotta say, the companions questline is like the one of the final ones that I did in the core game, like, in launch. At launch, I should say. Oh dear. We're getting so fucking chilled out here, it's no good. Jeez, where was that dragon at? But yeah, usually, you know, at least for me, typically I end up saving the... Oh, fuck! <laughs> Jeez, I just keep getting interrupted! Usually I end up saving the... What do you call it? The Dark Brotherhood in every game, or the Dark Brotherhood equivalent in every game for last, given, you know, the m very murderous uh, streak you end up going on, which we'll probably do here too, but in the case of launch Skyrim Land, I don't know why I put off the companion so much, right? Maybe it's because, like, I didn't fully recognize that, oh yeah, this, this is like the rough equivalent of a fighter's guild, <laughs> right? And I don't know, may maybe I just thought I had gone in into their building already in Whiterun. I just assumed I'd already been in there for something. But when I did it, it was it was so weird. It was like I, I just rediscovered an entire part of the city that I'd just gone by so many times and didn't really think much of. <laughs> I think in this playthrough, we have been inside of their building before though, right? I think we went in there... I don't remember why, but I'm pretty sure we went in there before for something. Because I think we saw the fist fight, right? Isn't there always, like, guaranteed to be a fist fight in there? I think so. Jeez, this is getting bad. How far off do are we? We're not too far off. Okay, you know what? Do we have any more super stamp potions? Maybe we just need to pop them. Just for such an occasion. Right? Heavens knows we don't need them during combat, right? It's a little unnecessary. More useful for just running nonstop. Okay. Maybe instead of drinking it, maybe I just like splash it onto my legs, right? Just running around, looking like I pissed myself all through the woods, through the snowy woods. Some of it starts to like freeze and crystallize on my pants. It's a little hard to run, honestly, with all the Fortify Stam and Stam Restorative just sort of crystallizing on me. It starts to like sound like rocks breaking or something, like some sort of cartoonish, like someone got, oh no, someone got turned into an iceberg in the cartoon, right? That's me and my legs. And you know what the best solution is for that? If you're going too slow, just need more Stam. <laughs> just splash some more on. Just melts it. Very, uh, very Ethan Winters maneuver. <laughs> okay. Let's see. How far off are we now? I think we can start... Yeah, we should be able to start going southward. 
right here. Very good. Man, it would have been so nice if that dragon showed up. But alas. We do actually have some hot food on us right now that we could eat, but... I don't know. You know, how role-playing games are. I feel, I feel like I gotta save it, you know? I feel like I need to save it. What if... What if there ends up being a situation where we're just kind of stuck? And then, I don't have it. Right? Remember when we needed the... To use the camp to fight the dragon? Or else we literally would have died? <laughs> Remember that? One of the very first few dragons that we ever fought? We would not have been able to fight it if not for that. Okay. Let's drink another one of these potions. Good. Alright. Over here. Oh, look, see? It's already becoming morning, I guess, because the... The lights are starting to, yeah. Nah! Go away, fade away. Oh, and it's getting warm too. Am I actually getting warm by the light or? Oh no, because we've just entered a warmer temperate area. But not temperate enough for the fish that we do seek, huh? Yeah, not temperate enough for that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's head on out through here. Good. I'm surprised that they don't have some kind of cool and amazing lift. Right? Some kind of rope lift? I guess maintaining that would be super duper difficult and all that. And maybe you don't want that kind of tech in your Elder Scrolls. But you know, shit, it's totally feasible, right? I mean, goodness. Why not have normal elevators, right? With ropes and pulleys? I could see it. How else do you think they haul around cargo off all these, like, East Empire Company ships? I mean, geez, you know, in, uh, in Solstheim. Fucking old Nelos Tower and shit. That had the magic lift. I mean, yeah, people used to fly around and stuff. We don't need to keep the elevators locked down to just Dwemer mechanics or whatever. Dwemer mechanisms and machines. Just have, like, a, a pulley system. Right? Have some pulleys. Let's go on over here. There we are. Okay. What an accursed place. It's got to be said. I can't believe we <laughs> we went through all this and there was just no fish. No fish whatsoever. How disappointing. How sad. I mean, that said, we did get some other cool fish. We'll have to remember to save them. Yeah, don't we need to... Can you build a fishing a aquarium? I think it is. I remember a while back, I was confused about the changes in the Hearthfire homes. How the, like... Uh, the hole in the wall, the cubby hole or whatever, where normally your vampire, like, coffin would go. That's actually for fish. But does each of the three places have a place for fish? Like, could you theoretically stock them all up? And then the other Hearthfire home, it's got the outdoor fish area, right? Where you can just put fish out there and they just freeze to death. Which seems like a great thing to do, so we would need... What, four or five of each fish if we really want to fill them all up? Jeez and Pete. Talk about a lot of fish. Wait, <laughs> I know you. Okay, here we are. And what's our best route to get over to Labyrinthian to deposit all this junk? Hmm. I guess Morthal, right? That's our best bet. There's nothing really closer. Unless we can find a dragon. Yep. I guess we're going to Morthal again. Okay. Can take you to any of the hold capitals. Where take me to, to Morthal, if you will. There Climb we go. And back and we'll be off. Lovely. Couldn't ask for better weather. You're telling me I was freezing my butt off. Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar. Uh, okay, we get a we get a free song this time. We get a free song. Oh yes. <laughs> Oh, man, don't quit your, your day job or whatever, I guess. <laughs> right? You're not a, a, a bard or whatever. You'd have to imagine that some of them do or would hire a bard to, like, sit in the back and sing. Maybe that would make it worth it? I don't know. Maybe only if you're, like, a carriage driver for really wealthy people. Then you could afford to have that kind of luxury. Okay, 
Let's rent a room here before we Finally, someone comes in. get screwed up in a major way. Stay a while. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. I got nothing but time these days. Okay. I'd like a room. There ain't much to offer, but if you want a place dry to spend the night... I do want sure that. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Oh, don't worry. I think I know where it's at. I'd be curious which inn we've slept at the most. I'm almost tempted to say it would be Morthal, you know? I'm very tempted to say that. I don't know if that's the case, though. Gosh, it might... Well... It's probably a three-way tie between, I would say, Morthal, the Winking Skeever, and maybe the Silver Blood Inn. You know? Now that I think about it. Maybe Windhelm, too. We may have hit up Windhelm a lot early on. Because we went to Windhelm Let quite a bit. And got a f quite a few things out of the way there. Maybe. Maybe. God's watch over your it's definitely going to be like cities speak, where we don't or didn't yard, quickly and early earn a a place of our own to sleep in, you know. Okay. Let's see. Let's place this marker down. There we go. Good. And I think, you know what, even these extra masks and stuff, I don't need to keep these with me or stow them somewhere. I may as well just throw them around and all that, right? Let me double check and make sure I've got the wooden one. Okay, we're good. That's probably the only one I'll keep on me, just in case, you know, it gets lost to time or whatever. Alright. I think we someone can't. a while, a law, a good while back, last time we did this, someone wrote in saying that sometimes there is a bug where, like, they despawn or disappear or something along those lines. Which shouldn't be no trouble for us, because absolute worst case, we can sort of take note of which ones we've collected and all that you know if we've if we get to the point where it's like well geez i've done every single one of them and i know i've stored them all here but they've disappeared we and we like know for a fact worst case we can just like use console commands to either spawn in duplicates or um forward progress the quest or whatever you know because you know deep in our hearts in our soul we'll have known we'll know that we've done it okay over here, and then we need to take a right up this way. Good. Honestly, you know, I'm surprised more people in Morthal don't talk about Labyrinthian. It's kind of like the biggest thing around that is in Solitude. More so, people are more concerned with the weird shit going on in the swamps, not this gigantic Labyrinthian place. You know? I'm surprised, you know, like the College of Winterhold when the college, or when Winterhold itself took all that beating, that they didn't relocate to, to Morthal to be closer to Labyrinthian to study shit. I don't know. Especially since they, were, they weren't exactly, and still are not to this day, exactly welcomed and beloved in... Oh shit, Ooh, I almost went into the fucking world. <laughs> but uh, they aren't exactly beloved in Winterhold as well. Oh shit. Troll Lord. Okay. Let's steal its soul. <laughs> cool. Take all that. Good. Oh dear. Let's also clear skies here. Get rid of that. And let's do it, huh? What was that? Oh, the Orcish Dagger, right, right through the heart. Okay. Cool. And then, what do we do? We just put on this, and then we get transported to another time. Cool. Alright. Look, our collection grows ever more. Yeah, we could stash them inside the treasure chests here if we wanted. This stuff doesn't respawn, right? Because it's not actually a dungeon. Or maybe... If you collect them all, does something spawn inside? Maybe we should just drop them. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Okay. There we go. Monkey! Do we have Volsing? I don't think so. Ragat? Nope. Heaven Narak? Nope. Wow. Amazingly, I kind of vaguely remember getting all... Well, not Nakreen. 
All of the other ones, though, I vaguely remember fighting them. Just not Nacreen. When did we fight Nacreen? I don't even know. All right. And you know what? Fuck it. Maybe I will just live dangerously. I'm just going to put the other ones in here. Right? I'm just going to fucking live dangerously and place them in there. Okay. Because we there's not like another equivalent of this where you need those for something. Now that would have been... That would have been something else, huh? Okay. And then... Let's see... Don our crown. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. Really, uh, really weird if you think too much about what the hell is even happening there. About how that goes on. What, what's happening? Are we going into an alternate reality? Are we traveling through time, back in time, to when it was more... Uh, I don't know. All together? Back into the time of the ancient Nords? I don't know. It's a little disconcerting. Okay, good. Now, let's head on over to get our fucking fish, huh? Let's do it. Should we... Should we tackle this by way of Riften? Or... Maybe we just roll up to... Do we have a... Yeah, we have a map for the Reach, don't we? Let's double check that. Fish. Or the rift, I should say. My bad. What the fuck is this? What the fuck am I even looking at here? What? <laughs> what is this? Where is this? Isn't it in the bottom right? That's the... That's like where Maven's meadery is, right? Where she gets all her honey, the beehives and stuff. But what's that to the left? What lake is that? Hold up. Is that the one by Iverstead? Is that it? Oh, shit, it is. So we actually need the one for Windhelm. Do we have that? No, we don't. Okay, so we need to go to Windhelm then and pick up a map there. Oh shit, is some asshole after us? Yeah, look out, Ral is behind you! No, Ral is no! <laughs> Jeez, look at him go. He's kind of a killing machine, you know? Very efficacious in murdering the shit out of everything. It's gotta be said. Especially after seeing that vamp murder. Goodness gracious. Okay, you know what? Let's lay down a marker for... Because we're only getting out of here by way of Windstat, aren't we? Move it over there. Good. We'll just travel up and along over this way. Very good. Okay. Neat. Ooh, shit. Not meant for horses, huh? Alright. Here's a question. Have we ever seen any evidence of the ancient Nords of yore? Oh shit. Who's this? <laughs> Who is this guy? Hey. Are you trying to fight me? What are you doing here, friend? Are you trying to fight me or some shit? Yield, and I may still show mercy. Uh-oh. Okay, I'll yield. Oh fuck. Hey, come on! Come on, here, I'm yielding, I'm yielding. I'm yielding! Oh, you're not gonna like this! What is this guy's fucking deal? Who are you? You don't even have normal armor! You're just some fucking guy! Got a lot of health, though, I will say that. What the fuck? Who was this? You're just some weird drug man. I'll take the drugs. I'll drink some of that. What in the world? Who was this dude? I'll take the blood wine too. Why not, right? Why not? 
fucking dude just came out of nowhere and decided to like start no. throwing hands. <laughs> Is this did we like anger the league of drug dealers or something? Cause I remember before in the past we had encountered like a string of three or four specifically I think Argonian drug dealers, skooma dealers and whatnot, right? They were all Argonian, I think, and had a similar get-up. Remember? And they would be like, uh, oh yeah, I got some good shit for you. And you could either just instantly be like, I'm buying it right here and right now. Or you could be like, this is very illegal. I'm going to tell on you. You're in big trouble, mister. <laughs> right? <laughs> and maybe we just angered them now permanently by doing something. Have we, like, made some choice that would now cause them all to be aggro as shit? I don't know. Maybe they just think that we're some kind of massive fucking narc now. <laughs> I don't know. Do you think maybe it's because we're wearing guard armor? They think that we're a guard? Because isn't my chest piece is is guard's armor? Technically speaking. I mean, it's enchanted and everything, but originally it would be designated as like Raven Rock guard armor. Do you think that registers with them? No. I don't think anybody in this entire game like, we'll change- we'll have a different reaction based on your clothing like that, would they? I mean, you know, let's not get ahead of ourselves. This ain't fucking Fallout New Vegas, right? <laughs> right? That can't be it, can it? That's all I could think of, though. Did we do anything that would piss off skooma dealers in the area? I don't think so. I don't think so at all. Huh. How odd. Alright. Well, let's head on over to Windhelm, I think. Do we need to drop anything weird off here while we're at this place? Oh, we could drop off some fucking fish, baby. Hell yes. I think that's exactly what we need to do. Clear skies, too, while we're at it. Alright. Go down here. Jeez, which fish have we deposited here, though? I don't even know anymore. I guess we can do a quick save ahead of time. Good. Okay. How about you? Can we actually put an angler in there? Okay. Arctic grayling? Okay. Brook bass? Oh, I've already done that. Carp? Already done that. Catfish? Already done that. The Pogfish? Already done that. Spadefish? Surely. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. I guess Hist Carp we could put in there because it's. Yeah, it's not like a super rare fish. Okay. Neat. Let's look for some more fish. Did we get any new ones? Any cool fish come back? Fucking A. Okay. Jeez, I'm. Ugh, we need a better way of doing this. Do we- can we not have a fucking net? We have the technology to build an entire fish hatchery that somehow defies nature, that, that can just spawn all of these plethora of different fish, and yet we can't have a- Look, we even got a net surrounding the fucking thing! We need a net for just scooping them up! I need a scoop! I need a fucking scooper every time I go in there, I'm like freezing my balls off, I'm gonna die! Jeez. Where do you want to go? Angar, get me the hell away from here. Get me to fucking Windhelm. One of the nicest, warmest places on all fucking Skyrim. Back and we'll be off. <laughs> the only thing more warm than Windhelm itself are the people who live there. Never met one of them cats. <laughs> They're all terrible. <laughs> I hear there's whole countries full of them down south. Alright. There we go. Jeez, and Pete, look at this. We're really being exposed to the elements in this one, huh? Very good. Let's heal ourselves up. Good. And we'll rent a room here before we head off on our fishing excursion. We should also rest up long enough that way the shops and stuff open, right? We actually do want them to be open, that way we can browse for a fishing map for Windhelm's hold. Okay. There we 
car. Oop, better stow this way. Good. <laughs> Easy there, Rallis. Okay. Head on inside of this. Welcome. Oh, let me know if you want anything. I do. I want a, Maybe an you inn. Should just move. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Okay. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Over here. Enjoy your stay. Pretty and sure this break. is it, right? Okay. Yeah. Good. Let's go for. Should we do five or six? Let's do six hours. Let's do six hours. Eleven a.m. Everybody should be open by then. Then. Okay. Good. Alright, we are still chilled though, which ain't great, but hopefully it's warm outside. If not, we can fix that. Let's see, clear skies. Good. What the hell? If you've I want to buy some to stuff. Sell, I've got the I give special rates to members of the okay, Thieves Guild. Okay. Show me what you've got. What have you got, though? Nothing that I'm looking for. You want this, though? <laughs> yeah, we'll get rid of that. Why not? Do we have any other weird circlets and shit? I think we do, right? Eh, maybe not. Eh, yeah, okay, nothing. How about over here? Scroll of Blizzard. Guardian Circle. Hysteria. Invis. Get rid of them. How about all this? Do I have, like, anything weirdly heavy? Nah, we're kind of... Oh, no, wait. Yeah, all these weird things we fished up. Right. Okay. How about over here? We can get rid of some trash poison. How about this? Fortify block. And we could use that for the magicka. This thing. Let's get rid of that. We'll take the hit. Good. Hurry back. And bring more merchandise. Who the hell would the general vendor be out here, though? My father says we need to just get on with our lives. Like it's that easy. Hmm? Who are you? Who is the vendor lord here? I made my fortune as a sea captain, but now I'm retired. It wouldn't be the smithy, right? Would it be one of the outdoor shops that sells the general goods that we want? Would it be you? Now here's a man I'm glad to see. Take a look. No. Who sells what I'm looking for? Do you think it would be in the Grey Quarter? Huh. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Man, I almost feel kind of weird calling it the Grey Quarter. I gotta say, I kind of paused there and thought about that. I was like, should I be calling it the Grey Quarter? This feels a little fucked up, especially with me being Dunmer. Like, what was it called before that? I, do we even know? I feel, I feel like, I, be, especially being Dunmer, I should probably refer to to whatever it was before, <laughs> rather than like openly accepting with calling it the Grey Quarter. Good day, friend. Okay, what have you got? Ah, so you're an alchemist then? No, you don't have what I'm looking for either. What the hell? We do have all this stuff, but frankly, mm -hmm. we don't want it right now. We're kind of good. Yeah, who the heck the would have it? Call me captain because I used to be a sailor. Because these are the only two, like, indoor shops, right? The rest are all the stalls, right? Other than over this way. I guess we'll check over here. Maybe they do have it over here. Sure. It's just, you know, normally you're way more keen to stop over at the market because it's just, you know, your one-stop shop. Just all these different vendors in one area. Whereas I think there's only, like, one or two over here. Definitely far fewer. Okay. Here we go. Good. Yeah, Sadri's used Take wares. A good look you know what? I bet you have I'm it. Sure you'll find what you're looking for. Let me see. see you. Take a look. No, you don't have it. What's going on, man? Who's got it? You're the general goods lord. Do come again. Who the fuck would have it? Who's got this shit? If not you, then who? I mean, you know the like sulfuric. Would it be the new Nisus, Nisus Corner Club? 
I don't know. Huh. Weird. Alright. Just so we're clear as well. In... In the Skyrim live-action trailer, where it's like a very Game of Thronesy looking kind of trailer, and there's like a dragon showing up, and people, it's like, it's like scenes and like, and shit of of people looking up into the sky, like, oh, what's that? Is a fucking I dragon the coming down? Would be a haven for my seat, kind. Get the cold out. I was wrong. But welcome, brother. That. Drink for the thirsty. That trailer, the that's set in Windhelm, isn't it? If you need another drink, I'll be right here. I think so. But, I don't know. I guess it's the, the city that looks close, it would look closest to Windhelm. I guess maybe the dragon is meant to come down like in the main courtyard area? I don't know. Do you know what I'm talking about though? That like live action Skyrim trailer from way back when? A, a dragon like shows up or whatever. Okay. Let's see. I guess we'll just hit up the the hot springs and whatnot. We'll see what we can find. Cause I don't know who else we would check for for a map. I thought for certain it would be if not anyone in the the main central market district, then it would be over at Sadri's, right? I don't know. Okay. Let's go on over here. Do we get clear skies still active? Because we are getting no. a few flirts. There we are. Cool. Now let's go on over here. Up we go. Now I'm assuming we're not actually going to like catch fish out of one of the like sulfur pools. Right? I don't know. What, what what kind of weird shit are we getting on now? Like like if we're getting on some weird Stardew Valley shit, maybe we are fishing out of a sulfuric acid pool or whatever it is. Right? Maybe there is something to that. Oh look. <gasps> Who's this? Is this a dude here? A fisher fisher folk? The King Fisher? Dude, I I I don't know where it came from, but every time I'm listening to some fantasy shit and they talk about Ah, the King Fisher or some shit like that. I fucking love it. I don't know who or what a kingfisher really fucking means, but it sounds cool as shit. <laughs> it sounds like something I want to be. I don't know what it is, but I want to be it. <laughs> I, can I be the kingfisher? Can I meet the kingfisher? I think there was like... Was it an inn in, like, The Witcher 2? I was, like, my most recent memory of something being, like, the Kingfisher Inn or whatever. The Kingfisher's respite. Yo, watch this thing get caught here. This is, like, a temperate stream, I bet. Sure, there's snow right there, but, you know, the temperature is a little weird here because of... We're kind of, like, at the edge of the biome or whatever. Jeez, listen to Prior Mabel fucking breathing really intensely. <laughs> kind of scare away all the fish. Or attract them. I don't know. If the little, like, ripples and stuff sometimes attract them. Shit, why aren't we throwing more shit in to attract fish, huh? Why don't I just start throwing swords and stuff in there? Maybe attract some more. Let's see what we can get. <laughs> Let's throw Rallis in there. See what kind of fish we'll catch. <laughs> <laughs> Only slaughterfish. The giant slaughterfish from uh, Oblivion inside that weird grotto or whatever. Jeez, could you imagine if that's in this game? Like a, an offspring of that giant slaughterfish? Alright. Feeling like we're not going to get anything good here. Let's see. We'll do one more. This is such a nice scene, though, of the bridge around Windhelm. And then Windhelm's, like, walls. And then the main, like, castle or whatever. What would you even call that? Would you call that a castle? The palace? The Great Hall. Ah, there we go. That's very Nord. Yes. The Great Hall of Windhelm. You know. Halls. Hallways. They have four stories to them. <laughs> the four-story hallway of Windhelm. Maybe a longhouse. 
It's it's long vertically. <laughs> right? I'm just going to start calling skyscrapers longhouses in real life. Ah, yes. Look at the craftsmanship on this fine longhouse. Hmm. What's in here? Ah, Fifth Third Bank. <laughs> they have spoken of you in the ancient tomes. <laughs> All right. Come on, one more. I think once we start getting just clutter, yeah, we should chill the fuck out on it. Whenever, yeah, that'll be our rule. Whenever we start getting, like, three fishes that are actually clutter, or like a non-living being, <laughs> or whatever you want to call it, once we get three of them, we'll, we'll back off of a fishing spot or whatever, you know? Could be a good idea. All right. I am really thinking that we're going to... F oh, you know what? I didn't put on the fucking hat for that. Of course we're not going to catch anything there. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. The bear lord. Okay. Let's see. Look, Prior Mabel is about to fire the fucking retrograde boosters and fly off into the sky. All right. There we go. Jesus Christ, Prior Mabel. <laughs> okay. Are we are we cool? Are we cool now? Oh, look at all these leeks being farmed here. Oh, lovely. Little did they know. Bears, they can smell leeks from miles away. Rizlov the Righteous, Dunmer, Hope of the Rhetoran. Oh, is the idea that this person here is Dunmary, perhaps? Pirate King of the Abishan. I guess it's possible. Though just as possible as well that maybe they were reading about. Oh look, fishing map East March! <gasps> this is what we want! Oh, there's none in a lake! It's all along this river. Good to know. Look, wow, so is this a new place or did they just populate it? Wait, is that a person under there? No, it's just the shoes. <laughs> okay. All right, well, it's good to know. Let's see. Fish. Oh, we've got two of them. So this is... Yeah, of course. This is East March. Who doesn't know that? Come on. Everyone knows it. We all know it. <laughs> Let's put our fucking hat on. <laughs> all right. Let's put on the fucking hat. And let's go for a little fish. Yes. Come on. Rain for me, baby. Oh, no, wait. We, we need to start fishing, right, for it to happen. And then the weather begins to change upon the fade to black. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's getting nasty looking out there. Hell yes. Give me that shit cloud rolling in. Ugh. Pour your dump all upon me. Let me catch an amazing fish. Dump right into the the river or whatever. What do we got? A little baby crab. Okay. Come on. Were they both catchable in streams? Or was it that they were both catchable in a lake? Fuck, I hope it's streams. <laughs> I hope it's streams real bad. Okay. Come on. Oh, it's a salmon. All right, we can do this. Look, how many more fishing spots we got after this? One or two? Even if we don't catch it at this one? Surely, one of the fucking other ones? I can envision it now. As if I have gazed into one of the Elder Scrolls themselves and become one of the priests of the blind moth, one of the brine, blind, one of the briny priests of the brine moth, I can see it. Just like how I can see sort of a weird cloud in the distance that looks almost like a dragon. Did you see that? Roll back the video like a few seconds right in the dead center where those two trees are like parted. It looked like a dragon. There's like an absence or appearance of clouds that looked like a dragon. Did you see that? It really looked like one. That was wild. All right, one more non-living creature and then we're good. Come on. 
come on. Oh. Pogfish? Okay. <laughs> we can do it. Surely, we will find what we do seek. Come on, baby. Give me that... Sunfish. Ugh. Disgusting. Alright. Let's carry on down this way. So which one are we at now? Let's see. Fish. East March. What have we got? So, we already saw the one at the, like, three-way hootenanny, right? Or are we at the near the bottom already? Are we near the bottom already? No. Okay. We just, we saw the one with the three-way hootenanny, and that's the one below it. So there should be one more along here. What is that over there? That's some dragon's tongue. Okay. Going over this way. What a weird shaped tree up there on the horizon. <laughs> weird. Very, uh, Minecraft looking. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Look, looking for these fish is doing something to me, and it's probably not for the best. The fishing quests and all that? It's got me acting away, and it's not great. It's cursed me. I'm going to, by the end of this, we're going to become like swims in deep water or whatever. Alright. Keep an eye out for fishing zones. Look, that might be one right there. A dark water pass or whatever. Oh, this fun-loving rabbit here, just as well. Okay. Yeah, this is it. Is this... Is this our favorite village? No, this is something else. This is Mixed Water Mill. Ugh. Why are you mixing with the water? Hopefully some amazing fish. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Let's see what we get. <laughs> Fuck me. There we go. Come on. Come on. Oh, look, there's actual fish in there, too. Hang on. Look, this is how desperate I am. Silverside perch. Cyrodiilic something. More perch. Is there any others? Show me the fish. Show me the fish. No more. Okay. The river is getting too white watery for this to be a good fish area. Oh, look. Fish. Fish alert. Fish alert. Could you imagine being whoever's working there? Just seeing this wild ass weirdo coming in here looking for fish? Just screaming, fish alert, fish alert! <laughs> Just a weird fisherman. Something like, my god, this madman. I think when he put on his hat, it started raining. What in the world? <laughs> you start thinking it's like an avatar of one of the nine divines. Could this be the manifestation of Kinnereth? <laughs> I heard that her glade was nearby this area. Could this be as it was foretold in prophecy? <gasps> you are sent one, one of the chosen of Kinnereth. <laughs> yes, fish alert, fish alert. I'm here for Kinnereth, fish alert. <laughs> Fuck, how cool. <laughs> They'll know of your coming with your word. Fish alert, fresh alert. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, come on. Come on, baby, come on. Give me that sunfish or pearl fish. Give me one of those fish. Give me that fish. River Betty, ugh. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. This is gonna be it. I can tell. Because we got shivery when, when we started summoning it. When we spoke the magic words. What the fuck? Well, it was no fish, but this is a new development. Ooh, it looks kind of cool. I kind of like the look of it. Unfortunately, it's two-handed, right? It's a warhammer. Yeah, I... Wow, fuck. If I were a two-handed dude, I would love this. This might be my favorite-looking two-hander, except for, uh... Uh, one of the uh, Creation Club ones, I think, adds in Stendars, right? Shit. Alright. 
Oh, right. We need to get our, our fishing rod reattached. How did we not find one of those already? You know, we've caught up so much weird junk. I'm surprised we haven't found one yet. What else are we missing? Like a... Have we found a two-handed Great Nord Lord axe or a Great Nord Lord super sword? Great Nord Lord sword? <laughs> Hell yes. Shit, that should have been our custom name for our two-hander when we were leveling two-hander way back when. The Nord Lord sword. Okay, one more. One more catch. And then we'll be on our way. Oh, shit. I reeled it in too early. My bad, my bad. Okay. Gosh, this does kind of take me back to Stardew Valley. <laughs> and catching the, the legendary fish and trying to catch them all. <gasps> Iron Sword of Torpor! Why did the... Dude, the Nord Lords of Ords! They screamed out when I got it! When I caught it! They loved it! Wow! When I came... When I devised... When I spoke in their ancient tongue and spoke of the Nord Lords, they yelled for me. They yelled. They yelled in pleasure. They were like, yeah. <laughs> That's what they said. They're like, yeah. We love it. <laughs> wow. Fishing really does something to me, huh? Wow. Look at that. Okay. One more. One more. After that, come on, we gotta get, we gotta get one more. We gotta get one more. We caught a big old slot. <laughs> gotta get one more. All right, come on, baby. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. Give me that fish. <laughs> Fuck off. Fuck off. Worst fucking spot. Mixed water mill, mixed with fucking disappointment, mixed with gloom and despair. Sheesh, I should have known. Weren't they already having issues? Something to do with this fucking mill? It's cursed? Didn't someone say it was cursed? Some bad shit's going down here? <laughs> I'm not surprised. Have you seen these fucking fish? All pieces of shit. Let's get the hell out of here. To the next fishing spot. Where's it going to be? <laughs> you better believe it's gonna probably fucking be a dark water pass or whatever. Or Darkwater Crossing, or whatever that town is that we love so much that I always forget the name of, because there's several names like it, and it's kind of a weird name. Okay. Is this... Is this a fishing zone? No. Are there actually fish here, though? Look. I could catch a goat in this water? If I can catch a goat in this water, surely I can catch some fucking fish. Look, the fish here? They look weird as hell. <laughs> You heard of a catfish. Now, goatfish. Hell yes. Eats anything. Okay. Over here. The goatfish. Known for... Oh. Oh. What is this? What happened? What have I discovered? The goatfish? <laughs> Congratulations, adventurer. You have discovered the goatfish. Very good. <laughs> a goat that screams at you. It bleeds at you. And every so often you'll find it climbing on top of... I don't know. What's the aquatic equivalent of a tree? Or something. You know, goats will like climb on top of stuff and they'll be in trees and scream at you. I don't know. Seaweed? <laughs> they climb to the tops of pirate ships. Every so often at sea, a bunch of sailors will be out singing their shanties, enjoying, and then they'll say, Come off the starboard bow! There's a flock of goatfish! A school of goatfish coming inbound! Private, turn the, turn the ship around! Turn the ship full sails! We need to get... No, oh, they're boarding! They start jumping onto their masts and stuff. They get up there. They start bleeding at them all. No! This is wrecking my mind. I'm it's terrible psychic damage is being wrecked upon me as I see these goatfish climbing all over our beautiful ship. <laughs> Good God. What a nightmare. Oh, fuck, I can't wait until that new ESO expansion and they put the goatfish in. Fuck me. <laughs> That's gonna be good. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Hell yeah. Add in the, the new sailing ships and the goatfish? Psh, fuck. 
what can't they do? Let's head on up here. Speaking of VSO, keep hearing rumors and stuff. Talk of their... Their new big... New IP and stuff. Which I'm, I'm vaguely curious about. Right? It doesn't have the, like, Elder Scrolls lore appeal for me. But maybe it'll be something fun. You know? If anything... We kind of thought for a while, I feel like, and certainly I felt it, that like maybe there wasn't that big of a demand for new MMOs and whatnot, but I feel like the rapid success of New World kind of showed that people are kind of hankering for a newer MMO or whatever, right? Despite the fact that I would say there's never been a better time to get into some of the older ones, right? Like... Uh, ESO, for example, and Final Fantasy, uh, 14? Ooh, shit. Was that lightning or a wizard? It was a lightning wizard. Okay. Faldrus. I'm on a pilgrimage to the Shrine of Azura, the goddess of twilight, if you'll excuse me. I think you're going the wrong way there, bud. I'm on a pilgrimage to the Shrine of Azura, the goddess of twilight. Okay. Filthy pickpocket. Oh shit. Hang on. I'll let you live this time. Thank you, Faldris. Thank you for sparing me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's continue on over here. Let's see. Yo, where are the fish at though? Where are they? Maybe it really is at the a dark water pass crossing. Maybe we really do need to roll over there and check it out. I think maybe that is the case, right? Haven't we been through there before? I can't remember. Did we see a fishing setup there? I bet there is, because isn't by default there's one there? Gotta be. I know we fished at this area before, but I don't think it was raining. Which is what we need for catching these other two. Alright, here we go. Come on, big money. Yeah, we definitely fished here, but it was not raining. It was a lot more beautiful looking. Which is kind of unfortunate that there's... <laughs> that you do need to do fishing while it's raining and stuff. Because it... For most of these very scenic views, it kind of spoils them. <laughs> kind of makes them look a little more, bit more shitty. Like, we can't quite see the beautiful multi-tiered waterfall in the background. You can just kind of faintly make out a... A vision of it, like an idea of it. Oh shit, not getting the full effect. I mean, we can't even see old Dirk Heathis in the distance swimming and getting kidnapped by the Falmer again, getting stuck inside of their weird, messed up, nasty den. There we go. Good. Okay. Do you think the Falmer know of Argonians and stuff? Like, were, were Argonians chilling out here in the time of the Snow Elves and whatnot? Or is this like a new and weird thing for them? I don't know. Surely there- were there ancient Argonians and like ancient Khajiit? Yeah, right? There were, weren't there? You never hear of them, like, interacting with each other. You always hear about, like, yeah, all these different fucking elves and different fucking humans and shit. Whatever happened when some fucking, like, Khajiit, some ancient Khajiit or some ancient Argonians show up to, like, knock on the Dwemer door or go say hello to the snow elves and whatnot? How's that go down? Probably same as it always does. They're just fucking racist as shit when it comes to the Dwemer. <laughs> like, oh, cool. A new kind of person to torture. <laughs> Great. Put them inside of the spinning blade arena and chop them up. Let's see in what new wonderful ways they will die and suffer. <laughs> Good God. Okay. Here we are. Huh. Okay. So far, no fucking dice, right? So far, it's looking pretty bleak. <laughs> this might be another situation where we're just shit out of luck when it comes to these fish. Maybe we used up all of our luck early on. I remember seeing someone who wrote in 
They were like surprised at how quickly and easily I caught these fish. Now, <laughs> now we're getting like the, the usual experience, huh? This is how it'll usually go, right? Maybe we need to look for the specific spawned in areas. Just speed it along and just pick a, pick the fish rather than actually catch them with the rod. Look at this. We're catching all sorts of shit, but not what we want. Not what we want. Maybe it's too late now for the sunfish, right? Maybe it's too late. Maybe we need to wait until it's like daytime. You know, when the actual sun is out. Okay, let's do it. Fuck it. Let's wait here for... Or let's go inside. Isn't there somewhere that we can use a bed? I think we have the key for this. Oh shit, do we not? Oh shit, spot. Oh god, okay. Oh dear. <laughs> Alright. Look, I'm in fishing mode. I'm in fishing mode. My, I'm like, my fingers are all slimy with scales and all sorts of fish slimes. Good lord. Okay. I should've just gone inside the fucking cave. The mines. <laughs> There's probably a bedroll up in there. I could've sworn we had stolen the key to this place. There we go. Hopefully, he ain't in here. Oh shit, he's in here. Look, the whole rest of the, your family is gone. Except for fucking you. You know what that means? I'm sleeping in your fucking bed now, dude. That's what it means. Let's go for 15 hours. That seems like the sun should be up. You know, the sun should be up. It should be good. If this doesn't work, for real, I'm starting to think we may need to, like, go pick up fish. How does that even work with the rain stuff? Does it still need to be raining to pick them up? I don't know. Could you please leave now? This is my house now. This is mine. You need to leave. Fuck off, Fern. You're not a thief trying to rob me, right? I'm just trying to rob you of a good night's sleep. <laughs> okay. That's right. I'm... A sleep paralysis monster. Oh look, now it's very clear out. Is the storm rolling in? We're still wearing our fun hat, right? Oh yeah, it looks like it's rolling in. Yeah, there we go. Fucking spade fish. Okay. Are we like not close enough to the the fishing zones or, or the the pools of sulfur or whatever the fuck? Maybe maybe that's it. Shit me. All right. Catch some of these. Some perches, some beddies, some dragonflies. Anything else up in here? Should I just like start grabbing fish all over the place? Salmon. What was that? What was that? Oh, there's another salmon. What's over there? Where are those? Look. More fish. Ooh, look at these. What could these be? River Betty. Hist cart. Here, if I just scream right into this. Oh, fuck yes! <laughs> oh, yeah. Who needs dynamite when you have this? Look at them all. Yes, man. Yes. Oh, I'm catching the row too. Mmm. Yum, 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 yum. That's a delicacy in some parts. All right. Fuck. Who needs a fucking fishing rod when I can just scream them up? All right. Great. Well... You know what? We may need, we may fucking need to go and look up where to just go pluck these fish. We've had some amazing fishing adventures, but you know what? Perhaps it has gone on for a little far too long. L lest we forget, you know, we'll honor and love all the amazing fishing adventures we had in the past and how how we got here and all that. And uh, lest we'll never forget all the good times we had running around with Rallis and catching fish and talking about weird fish and stuff. 
<laughs> Such good times. But it needs to stop. It no. needs to stop. We need to find these fucking fish. Ever since the weather component got added into this, I can't fucking figure it out, dude. Look at me. I'm a fool. I'm no Fisher King. I'm no King Fisher. I'm Fisher Price. That's what I am. I'm a fucking baby. <laughs> but next we come back, I guess we'll have to look up where the fish are. <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> Until next time, please take care of each- Wow, this is actually beautiful. Take care of each other.